Hello there. I wanted to, uh, this is Candace, and I wanted to share with you Life of Fred Fractions, as serious as it needs to be, Stanley F. Schmidt. Um, a lot of his books, I got these at a, uh, actually a book, used book thing, and uh, these books are really well made, so they can last through a bunch of people, or a bunch of families, which is excellent. Um, here we go. He goes through less than, a billion, cardinal and ordinal numbers, diameter and radius, Fred's budget, doubling fractions, comparing fractions, reducing fractions, add and reduce, subtracting fractions with the same denominators, common denominators, Roman numerals, adding fractions, fractions mean divide, and so on and so forth. I actually missed, I went on vacation or something with my family in fifth grade when we went over some of this fraction adding and subtracting stuff. And I, it, it confused me for some years, but I um, wish I had this book. So the first couple sections are covered in a, in a very rudimentary way in the Life of Fred Elementary Math. Um, he goes through cardinal and ordinal numbers a lot. And so this is some of it's looking. The stories aren't looking familiar, but uh, that type of information is looking familiar. So what Stanley F. Schmidt likes to do is he'll put some language arts and he'll put some history and a bunch of stuff in in these books. So it's not just um, it's not just flat out math. It's not a boring textbook. It's very interesting. So. But he does it in such a fun way that it's like you're tricking your child into learning, and not even, not even tricking them. They they just want to because I know when I read to uh, read the Life of Fred uh, elementary math to our son, he just does not want to stop reading it pretty much ever. So once again, this is the Fractions math book. It's pretty thick, uh, but it's got a lot of information in it. So you can see that, I mean, that's, that's a pretty good thickness there. There you go. All right, so I'm hoping you get uh, good um, information from that. So, <laughs> sorry, I just read at the bottom that Stan's mom reviewed the book, which... I'm sure that's not biased at all. Anyway, he's so funny, guys. These, these are great books.